Hi, and welcome back to Branford Webs. This week you join us in our new um, multi-span house that we built earlier this year. So this opened in March. It's a 4,000 metre um, Kader house, um, fully automated electronic sides that can drop down, ventilating out of the roof too, so we can get a real good airflow through here. We've already had a couple of crops through this this season, and now we're busy potting lavenders for 2023 sales into here. You can see the team just putting them down on the beds as we speak. So this will rapidly fill up over the next few weeks with crops ready for sales in spring 2023. But now for this week and lots, lots looking good at the moment in the nursery. So the key product line we've put online this week is our Autumn Magic range, which is a three litre range of shrubs designed to become the backbone of people's gardens. So to stimulate the autumn planting season as we go into late August and into September, and as we've seen in the last couple of days, certainly here in Worcestershire, the weather breaking down with the heat get descending a little bit and again some more rain and thunderstorms going through. So I'll show you a brief sample of what's in the Autumn Magic range and then follow the rest of the video so you can see more what's looking good around the nursery this week. So the range consists of a mixture of evergreen and deciduous shrubs to really give autumn interest to the garden. So here we've got Burberry's Harlequin which has got that lovely um, sort of dark burgundy and cream flecked leaf at the moment. But as we get into the autumn, this just turns a vivid red colour. It's a real splash of autumn colour from Burberry's Harlequin. Evergreen structure too with um, Escalonias. So this is um, Gold Brian. I'll also show you we've got online um, Red Dream as well. And um, IVI is also in the range. So good, chunky, three litre shrubs. The Red Dream's just got a bit of bud coming in there too. So good autumn colour and good structure throughout the year. Then early autumn flowering with Ceres of Stigma, so that's Ceres of Stigma Forest Blue. Not an easy thing to say at this time in the morning. Um, really good again, chunky plant, three litre, good backbones um, to any border you're planting. And then good autumn flowering plant again, this not quite in colour yet, but this will bud up as we go into the autumn, but Hypericums. So we've got two in the range, so we've got Hidcut, the good old fashioned one, real stalwart of most um, planting schemes. And also we've got a little mystery which gives that nice um, golden green variegation for a contrasting colour and a splash of foliage colour through the border. Back to evergreen structure and um, keeping that year round colour and we've got Euonymus Cathy. That lovely sort of cream and green variegation, that cream margin really stands out. Looks lovely and again good chunky plants. And last but not least to show you this week we've got Physocarpus Lady in Red. Again, good foliage colour, a good foil to many things in the garden, great at the back of the border with colour in front of it. Um, so really good structure in the garden and then really good strong autumn colour as that turns its red and oranges as we go later into the year. That's it for this week, continue watching the video and we'll see some more stuff that's looking good around the nursery this week. Goodbye for now.